fellow members of the Long Gray Line. Greetings from West Point and happy Founders Day. Founders Day is a time for us to come together and grip hands as graduates to celebrate the founding of the national treasure that is the United States Military Academy and to celebrate the strength and timelessness of the Long Gray Line. Most importantly, as your superintendent, this is an opportunity for us to say thank you for all that you do for our academy and the Corps of Cadets. Not only for your continued and generous support, but also for your example of honorable leadership and selfless service. As the Army's gold standard for leader development, the Military Academy contributes to Army readiness through its enduring mission to educate, train, and inspire the leaders of character who will live honorably, lead honorably, and demonstrate excellence as Army officers. This is not a college or a campus, it's so much more. We're an academy, a living, breathing leadership laboratory that prepares these young men and women to lead, fight, and win in the Army of 2030. Within this leader laboratory, the path to graduation might look different than when you were a cadet, but remains rigorous, realistic, and challenging. From military science and physical education classes, to character discussions and summer developmental experiences, the military, physical, and character training overseen by our staff and faculty ready our cadets to lead in the crucible of ground combat on the 21st century battlefield. Training and curricula for our cadets is enhanced by simulations, technology, and enablers, helping us to develop critical thinkers ready to tackle complex problems and to inspire those they serve beside. I am incredibly proud of the academic program and the rigorous education our cadets are receiving. Our world-class military and civilian faculty are ensuring that every cadet is a critical thinker, able to thrive in the complex and uncertain environment of the current and future battlefield. Our graduates receive a range of tools and the ability to integrate ideas across domains. Because of this breadth of education, cadets are ready to solve complex problems and outthink our adversaries. Of course, the whole curriculum is underpinned by the United States Constitution. It is the foundation for everything we teach about professionalism, service to the nation, and our duty as Army officers. Enhancing our cadets' education is the Academy's culture of innovation and research. West Point has increasingly become the intellectual engine of the Army's innovation ecosystem. When our cadets conduct research and scholarship, they grapple with real-world problems that directly address the Army and our nation's most complex challenges. Our curriculum, faculty, research, and innovation are all in an excellent place. They are world-class and are all grounded in the same mission, educating and inspiring leaders of character to fight and win our nation's wars. As we celebrate Founders Day across the world, we are continuing to recruit young men and women who will represent us in a first-rate fashion. For our coaches, they're here to develop leaders of character. They're charged with recruiting, educating, training, and inspiring young men and women on the pool, on the court, on the field. They're here to develop grit and resilience and tenacity so that our young cadets not only learn how to win in competition, but they lead within the core. We're not recruiting young people to come here to improve their draft stock for a professional athletics opportunity. That'll never be the case. We recruit young people of high character who are attracted to come here to serve our country. And by the way, we're still having plenty of success. Seven star victories over the Naval Academy to date this year, including the historic double overtime football win back in December in Philadelphia. On behalf of 250 athletics department employees and nearly 1,200 cadet athletes, thank you for what you do to support this great academy. And as always, beat Navy. To my fellow members of the Long Gray Line, I hope you're having a great time celebrating the birthday of our great institution. Character development continues to be the highest priority of our efforts here at the Military Academy. And it's a critical part of building leaders for the Army of 2030. As combat becomes more complex, more fast-paced, more uncertain, one thing that is true is that the ethical demands will remain high. And we recognize that at West Point, our graduates must be the gold standard for America, for their fellow soldiers, for the non-commissioned officers that they lead. Therefore, we must continually live honorably, lead honorably, and demonstrate excellence in everything we do, always doing the right thing, the right way, at the right time. If you've been to West Point recently, 
you can't help but notice the construction and renovations taking place throughout the entire installation as part of our ongoing long-term effort to modernize our infrastructure and more importantly, expand our capabilities to ensure we are preparing our graduates for the future operating environments of this century. The future Cyber and Engineering Academic Center is coming out of the ground nicely and on schedule, and our multi-year program to upgrade our academic buildings is well underway. Additionally, renovations at Camp Buckner continue, and our cemetery expansion is nearly complete, which will extend capacity out for several decades. You've seen just a taste of the excellence taking place here each and every day as we develop the next generation of leaders for our Army. It's a team sport, and you're an important part of that team because it takes all of us to prepare these outstanding young men and women for the awesome mantle of leadership. Through your generous support, you enhance our ability to educate and train the next generation of Army leaders. Equally as important, you inspire them through your example of leadership, excellence, and selfless service. Please continue to be advocates for both the Academy and the United States Army by sharing the value of service with young Americans and highlighting the possibilities we have to offer through service. You have the unique opportunity to help us identify qualified talent and share your stories and experiences and inspire them to be part of something bigger than themselves. Your honorable service will help our qualified applicants see themselves as soldiers and future commissioned leaders of character. We invite you to come back to your alma mater and see the excellence for yourself and to grip hands and inspire these incredible young Americans. In turn, they will inspire you with their dedication and commitment to service. Thank you for all you do. Happy Founders Day. Go Army, beat Navy.